when it comes to me imagining myself getting breast cancer. It's a, it's such a fear that I completely ignore it. Yes, I'm talking about it, but I'm not I'm not really thinking about it. It'll always remain just an illusion in my mind. I don't know if I'm strong enough. My grandmother was the first time. My grandmother seemed like a strong woman. She seemed like she had a hard life, but <laughs> I like all I know is her smiling face. The, all the pictures of her, of her smiling. So I have every memory. I remember her smiling. It's a fear to do something so close to you. I wonder if she held my mom when she had problems. But the more I do it, the further I'm, I'm pushing myself away. I don't know why it's so hard. I love her so much. I would do so much for her. I'm unrooted. As if I'm not even from from my mother. I feel like I've been taken away. I can imagine my grandmother. And I can imagine her loving me and me loving her. But it's not even in the slightest way real. It's not real at all. I don't know how you love someone you don't know. I love her picture. I love stories about her. I love I love looking at her face in old photographs. And I feel like I know her from my mom. I feel so connected to her face, like an old, an old dream, deja vu, it's not quite there, but just a slight hint of it, but it may not even be real.
emotions there. It's just a, a little hole. I mean, how can you cry over somebody you never knew? have known them, have known my, my other side, my other family. It's half of me is missing, half of where I come from is gone. Um, I'll never know where my mother came from. I'll never know so much about my mother. I I know so many of her stories, and I love listening to them over and over and over again. And I have her retell them to me. I'll never see her face and how she smiles when she looks at her mom. 